Hi, this is Pompberry, and today I'm going to be showing you how to do cream contour for beginners using the Misho Beauty contour stick. So the reason we contour is to sculpt and define our facial features, and cream contouring is especially good for beginners because it's super easy to blend out. It's kind of foolproof. So you'll want to place the contour wherever there are shadows naturally on your face, so under your cheekbones or anywhere you want to define like for example the sides of your nose along the forehead and you can also do under the chin to blend it out i like using a kind of big fluffy brush and i like to almost pat it out using this motion you can see i'm blending the product very very easily and i'm also controlling where it's going it's not just going all over my cheek we want to keep the area kind of precise because we're trying to mimic a shadow. So we're trying to detract from the face, whereas highlights, they add volume to the face and contour takes away volume from the face. You can do this with a sponge as well. I'm just used to using brushes. It's my preferred method, but honestly, play around and see what works for you. You can even use your fingers. I love this as well. You don't need fancy tools to enjoy makeup. Feel free to play. That's the fun of makeup is you can kind of see what works best for you, what you like, what you prefer. It's different for everyone. For contour, especially you want a cooler tone to mimic a shadow. You're not going for a bronzer where we would put the bronzer higher up on the cheek to mimic that sun-kissed look. Here, we're really trying to mimic the shadow. So if you look at your own natural shadows, you'll see that it's a cooler tone. It tends more gray, less orange, more gray. As you can see, it's all blended out. It's all done very fast, very simple. And now to complete the look, I'm just gonna add a little bit of blush and highlight using the Alamara Viva Las Chicas palette. For this, I would use a looser fluffy brush than I did for the contouring. I'm just going to very lightly dab the blush and then again pat it on do little taps and blend it out i'm placing the blush right on the apples of my cheeks so we contoured down here the blush goes above it and concentrating it right on the apples when you smile it's that little area right here to help your highlighter blend in with your blush i'm going to go in with the same brush that i used and just very lightly tap into the highlighter, and you wanna put the highlighter slightly above the blush. And it'll really help to accentuate your cheekbones uh, because we contoured to sculpt the area under them, and now we're adding a highlight to make them really pop. Super simple, super fast. You can incorporate it in your day-to-day -day if you want, or play around with it and have some fun. Let us know what tutorial you'd like to see next in the comments down below, and don't forget to like and subscribe Ipsy's channel. Thanks for watching, bye.